Hey everyone, welcome back to Error Genie. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to check if someone is spying on your phone, whether you're using an Android or iPhone. This is going to be a quick and easy step-by-step -step guide, so let's jump right into it. Step 1. Look for camera and microphone usage indicators. On both iPhone and Android, modern phones show visual indicators when your microphone or camera is being accessed. On iPhone, an orange dot at the top right means your microphone is in use. A green dot means your camera or both camera and mic are active. If you see either of these and you're not on a call or using video, that could be a red flag. Step 2. Dial a secret code. You can dial this hidden code to check if your call or data is being forwarded. Open your phone app. Dial asterisk number 21 number and tap call. If the screen shows call forwarding disabled across the board, you're good. But if you see any services enabled and you didn't set them up, someone might be redirecting your communication. Step 3. Check call settings. Go to your settings, then phone, then calls on other devices. If you see devices you don't recognize, turn off access immediately. Also check call forwarding. If it's turned on but you never set it up, disable it right away. Step 4. Text message forwarding, iPhone. Head over to settings, then messages, then text message forwarding. If an unknown device is listed, toggle it off. Someone could be receiving your text. Step 5. Location tracking by apps. Go to settings, then privacy and security, then location services. Check for any arrows beside apps. That means they've accessed your location. If an app you haven't used recently shows an arrow, tap it and switch location access to never. Step 6. Battery usage, Android, iPhone. Check if suspicious apps are running in the background. Open settings, then battery. You'll see which apps are draining your battery. If an app shows high usage and you didn't use it, it could be spyware. Uninstall anything suspicious. Final tips, keep your phone updated with the latest security patches. Install a trusted antivirus or anti-spyware app. Avoid clicking on suspicious links or downloading unknown apps. And that's it. If this video helped you, make sure to give it a like, drop a comment, and subscribe to Error Genie for more step-by-step -step troubleshooting and tech help. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.